Hi there, just answering your request to explain why unregulated air pollution in automobiles could shift a, I'm sorry, not shift, could move a country's production inside the PPF. So what I thought I'd start off by doing here is drawing you an example for some random country of a bowed out production possibilities curve, clean air on the vertical axis, it being a public good, automobile on the horizontal axis, being a private good. Any line or any point on the line for a PPC represents in a, or it represents efficiencies for that production. So any line I hear means we're using all of our factors of production, we're completely efficient, doing everything we can possibly do, met our full potential, it's great. So I just put an arbitrary point on the production possibilities curve because based on the statement that you had provided, it is implied that they are currently producing on the on the production possibilities curve and we're no longer on the curve, we're in it, which makes sense. So when we're producing on the curve, we have efficiency. When we're not producing on the curve, we don't have efficiency. And there's different types of inefficiencies. The most common one that you've probably talked about before are unemployed resources, okay? Or when there's bankruptcies or things of that nature, those are the most common examples of when we're producing inside. But another type of efficiency is when markets aren't recognizing their true scarcities, um, i.e. the air pollution, okay? So when, the, when there's deregulation of things that can hurt the environment, then that can lead to a different type of inefficiency. And when you have these inefficiencies and the businesses are not uh, correctly facing the prices that they should be, there's not the true uh, costs are not reflected in there, then the economy is going to move. In this case, it moves from point A to point B. We also have less on the vertical axis for the clean air, obviously, but we also could have more automobiles as a result of this. All right. So if we decide to get efficient regulation of this air back, then certainly we'll move back onto the production possibilities curve. But until then, it's represents any type of environmental, anything bad to the environment could represent a different type of inefficiency, which this certainly does. And that efficiency should also be reflected by producing inside the PPF. So I hope that was helpful and uh, have a great day.